Hello and welcome. We are here in Brooklyn, New York to cover all the action in tonight's Brooklyn Styles Finals. Rob Stone here along with my colleague, the Hall of Famer, Randy Peterson. All right, Randy, tell me, what was your approach to events like this when you were competing? Rob, these players want to string strikes early and get out to a quick lead to force their opponents to play catch up. The competitors are ready to go, so we're going to bring the action to you right now. A good start right there. Yeah, nice start. Strong right out of the gate. Anthony Simonson set to go now. One of the bright young stars here on the PBA Tour. Simonson, the youngest bowler ever to win two major titles. A strike to start things off. Trying for the double now. And there's the double. Looking to keep it going here with two in a row. Thought they were all going in the pit, but the 10 stands. You see how often the 10 pin is converted 95% of the time. Got it. and only the 10 pin remained. The 10 pin gets converted 95% of the time. No problem on that one. Try and make it three in a row here. Picks up nine pins. Easy conversion there. That, my friends, was a nice looking strike. Struck in the last frame, looking for the double here. Here you see the max score each player can get. Two strikes in a row. for two in a row. Another strike. Two in a row now. Great execution on the last two shots. Uh, 
Working off a double now. Oh, left one standing. No problem. Looking for three in a row now. And the string keeps going. Makes a nice shot there for a turkey. Trying to keep this strike streak alive, going for the hambo. Hambo! That's what it looks like when you start getting into the zone. There's a nine count. And no problem there. You can see how the strikes have come on the left versus right lane. Right at it. Punches 10 back into the pit. We've seen a ham bone so far. Locked in. Strike. The strike train keeps getting longer. Working off five in a row now. Impressive performance so far. Here's the max scores if both players strike out. There's the six back in the zone. Got a strike on the last turn. Got it! Now at two strikes in a row, will we see three? We just might. You get three strikes and you're not out. Looking for the ham bone here, four strikes in a row. Leaves the seven there. Will we see seven strikes in a row? I'm not doubting anything at this point. Must strike here for the win. That'll do it, folks. He's moving on. Working off seven straight now. I mean, we're really seeing some great shots here.
Ringing seven, four around the bottom of the seven. Ninety three percent conversion rate on the seven pin. All right, that'll do it, folks. We hope you enjoyed all the bowling tonight. Take care. Hello and welcome. We are here in Brooklyn, New York to cover all the action in tonight's Brooklyn Styles Finals. Thrilled you're here with us today. Rob Stone and the Hall of Famer, Randy Peterson with you. As a competitor, what are you thinking about going into tonight? All the competitors who made it this far are obviously bowling really well right now. You have to stick with what's been working for you. Game two of the finals coming at you right now. Gets the strike to start it off. There's a nice shot and a nice result. Here's the master technician, Norm Duke. That's how you start. Got a strike on the last turn. Looking to get on a streak now, hunting two in a row. Got it! Just what you want to get it going on TV. The lights are on and the pressure is cranked up. Looking to keep it going with the triple. You get three strikes and you're not out. Already with the double, looking for a triple. Someone is heating up. Picks up eight pins, leaving the two and six. Something went wrong on that one, Randy. Yeah, you just got to be more accurate than that to have any chance in these competitions. Looking for a smooth delivery here. Well, that was perfect. Dead solid perfect. In for the ham bone here, four strikes in a row. Knocks down eight pin, leaving the three and six. You see the conversion percentage there, not too difficult for the pros. And a nice conversion there.
there you see the max scores. That, my friends, was a nice looking strike. Struck in the last frame, looking for the double here. Two strikes in a row. Now at two strikes in a row, will we see three? We just might. Strikes again. Feeling it now. Trying for the double now. Another strike. Two in a row now. Great execution on the last two shots. We'll try and make it three in a row here. Three in a row for the turkey. Working off a turkey, trying to upgrade to a ham bone. That's a ham bone. The question now is, can you maintain this pace and intensity? Going for the five back. Here we see the strikes on each lane. him down again. Some great concentration, great focus, and some really good bowling. Trying to keep this strike streak alive. Going for the hambo. There's the hambo. You betcha. been delivered. Looking for a five-bagger now. Our graphic here shows the potential max score. The strikes just keep coming. Five in a row now. The strike streak is at five right now. This is what it looks like when you have the hot hand. Perfection. Brings down the hammer again, another strike. Looking to keep the streak going here. Got another strike. Oh man, the perfection continues. Seven bagger in the bag. Will we see eight? I'm expecting it at this point. Eight straight strike. Looking for nine in a row now. Someone's having fun right now. Working off five in a row now. Impressive performance so far.
Here you see what he needs to win. There's a 7-10 split. Ouch. Ouch is right. Left the goal post there, and unless you use the split ball, the best chance is to throw the high ball. Fails to convert to no one's surprise. You know, Rob, I used to pick up the 7-10 all the time, but it seemed like it always happened when no one was looking. And that wraps things up for us, folks. We appreciate you joining us.